The Nigerian Association of Resident Doctors said it will continue its indefinite strike amid the suspension of its planned nationwide protests. NAD President Dr. Innocent Oji said this in an interview, adding that the Federal Ministry of Health had not reached out to the association. Recall that NAD had commenced an indefinite strike on July 26 after a two-week ultimatum to the federal government for the implementation of all age demands elapsed. The demands of the doctors, among others, include immediate payment of the 2023 Medical Residency Training Fund and the immediate release of the circular on one-for-one -one replacement. The association also demanded payment of skipping arrears and upward review of consolidated medical salary structure comments in line with full salary restoration to the 2014 value of comments. Meanwhile, the federal government has appealed to the doctors under the National Association of Resident Doctors, NAD, to suspend the ongoing industrial action. The federal government assured the doctors that the government will fulfill the demands in a few months. Briefing journalists, the Permanent Secretary, Federal Ministry of Labor and Employment, Mrs. Kacholom Daju, recalled the meeting between the government and NAD where the issue of non-payment of salary by Abia State Government, review of unbottling medical doctors' licenses for five years' practice, a bill sponsored by a member of the Federal House of Representatives, payment of the 2023 Medical Residency Training Fund, immediate release of the circular on one-for-one -one replacement, and upward review of the consolidated medical salary structure comments were raised. The Permanent Secretary stressed that within the period of May 19th and July 17th, when they had another meeting, the government assured the resident doctors that they are working towards meeting their needs. I'm using this medium to kindly appeal to the National Association of Resident Doctors that please, Nigerians are dying in rules. That's the truth. The health sector is a very, very important sector. Not that any other sector is not important. They're all important. But we all know what medical doctors are to us. If we are ill today and you can't go to a hospital, what happens? People are dying. People cannot care for themselves. So I'm begging them and I'm imploring. And I'm lending my voice to the voice of all members of government who have appealed to them to please call off their strike and go back to work. I know that your parent ministry alongside other government agencies are working hand in glove to ensure that this matter is sorted out. We're talking about the lives of our citizens. We're talking about the lives of our children. We're talking about the lives of the populace who depend on you for medical services. And I want to reiterate this government's commitment to peaceful resolutions. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.